The question on how to export points and surfaces from Carlson to Scylla 3D has come up to me a few times over the last few weeks in conferences and meetings. Figure it would be time to do a quick refresher on how to do that. Okay, so I have a project in Carson. Uh, points were already imported and processed. Uh, surface was created. And, you know, you can see the contour lines here. So let's go ahead and go to the file menu, export uh, Civil 3D. All right, so the first question is the drawing name. So I'm going to just rename this one uh, Practice to Civil 3D. Okay, save. All right, now we need to tell the software, go ahead and convert points, surfaces, and if we have surfaces, click on Add, highlight the surface, in this case existing, hit OK, and then hit OK again. All right, the process will just go through. If you had a few more things like alignments and sections, that would also be exported out into the Civil 3D format. Okay, it's done. Exported all the points, created the surfaces, we're good to go. All right, now from the Civil 3D side, I wanted to show you guys the result. So let me open that uh, practice drawing. A couple of shape files I, I didn't get from them, but that's fine. I'll ignore that message. And okay, let's have Civil 3D finish opening. There we go. Uh, yep, or a couple of sort of references, a couple of images that I didn't get either. So that's fine. All right, uh, wrap it up. There it is. Okay, let me zoom a little tighter to there so you can see kind of that surface. There it is. All right, so let's go ahead into uh, tool space and prospect and change surface properties. Uh, let me switch this from that 2 shade to, there you go. Contour lines, 2 and 10 background. Uh, let Soul 3 refresh the model. There it goes. Uh, let's look at the point groups here. Uh, let me highlight all points. And there they are, all the points exported out. So the surface and the points in Civil 3D. Well, I hope that this video on how to export surfaces and points from Carlson to Civil 3D was helpful. So thank you for watching.